What's up and welcome to another episode of Kicking It With Moats. I got the honor and privilege to have my KK, my A1 day one here, helping me talk about shoes. Now, anyone that knows me, you know me especially. Mm -hmm. I love my shoe, KK. I love my shoe. And anybody that watches our videos know that, hey, it's a ton of shoes that are always in the background and people want to know about my favorite shoe. You know, hard to have a favorite. <laughs> it's like having a favorite child. You know you're my favorite. <laughs> but it's like having a favorite child. It's hard. You know, you can't have just one favorite. So with that being said, I can't pick which shoe I want to introduce to the people first. Mm -hmm. I can't. But that's why I got you here. Because when it's time to get dressed, you're my confidant. You're the one who get the shoes going and we get it popping. So, KK, I'm going to let you pick the first shoe that we're going to introduce to the people. Okay? So take your time. I know it's a lot in here. You got action. <laughs> but I'm going to let you pick. Heat check, heat check, Lord, Lord, Lord. <laughs> We're going with the Jordan One. Wings? Oh, KK, I love my wings. If you can see on the background right here, let that camera zoom in on it. That's the wing right there. Obviously, because Jordan's wings and things like that. But man, this shoe. I mean, just in general, the Jordan One itself is iconic because of the history behind it, right? Yeah. This is Jordan's first signature shoe. And at a time when Nike wasn't even popping like that, right? Nike was more of a track shoe. But it's good to see that not only have they kept to the, you know, the basis of this hot top Jordan 1, but then they did something funky with it. And this wing concept is dope because you see the colorway on it, right on top? Yeah. It's a dope colorway. But underneath it, right, you can rub all of this color off and you're gonna get this look right here. So you see? There, make sure you show the camera. That wing look that's on the sole of the shoe, that covers this whole shoe, which you'd have to rub this off. Now for me, I'm too much of a pump. I'm never gonna do it. Besides, I love this look and it's a clean look. You can dress it up or dress it down. But for those that are a little bit more on the uh, exotic side, just know that that's in there available to you. So, great pick while you're on the first one, man. That's how you, that's how you start it off, Boogie. That's how you start it off. But I will say this, I'm a little surprised by you. <laughs> you acting different. We get the camera in here and you start acting different. <laughs> all these shoes that we wear together, we twin all the time. All the time. All the time. And you gonna pick a shoe that we not twinning with. It is. <laughs> but you act like you don't have heat on your feet right now, KK. I'm going to this one right now, KK. I I'm not even gonna wait, you know why? Man. She gets me. She gets me. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's the Jordan 4 right here. You got the wolf gray, cool gray colorway on this thing right here. Absolutely love it. It's a timeless shoe. I mean, the Jordan 4 by itself is iconic. I mean, you think about the historic performances that Jordan had in this. Everybody remembers the shot against the Cleveland Cavaliers. He was wearing this. Now, not this colorway, but he was wearing this shoe. Now, anytime you throw this gray look on it, we always love it because goes with everything right this is like your go-to this is like a great jordan is like the gray sweatpants for guys you know what i mean you put or, or leggings for girls you know what yeah. i mean like this this the go-to is comfort but you know you can never go wrong with this shoe and you can speak for yourself about hooping in it right yeah i mean you like when you hoop in them i do you usually get buckets too <laughs> you get buckets i don't see you block a couple shots in these so shout out to the jordan four even though kk didn't want to pick these today <laughs> ha yeah yeah Acting so brand new, so brand new. <sighs> Let's see, I think we just showed them what two, two heats right now. Yeah. Should we give them one more? Yeah, you pick, sure. the, you pick the next one. But but do they deserve one more? Cause usually, usually we don't give them this type of content. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. <sighs> it's up to you. If you're feeling generous, <laughs> we'll show them one last shoot. I think we should show them one more. All right, ladies and gentlemen, shout out to KK. She's gonna let y'all get one more shoe. Now I gotta decide because we've been sticking to just this portion, right? Mm -hmm. Obviously we did the Jordan 1, we did the Jordan 4, but I'm contemplating, do we stick with another Jordan for this first video? Or do I give him like a chunky donkey? Do I give him a Yeezy? Do, you know what I'm saying? Like we got some options with this. Oh, you know what? I got it. Yeah, yeah, the one. I'm gonna go cherry. I'm gonna go with something with a dope story. A crazy colorway. And it's an iconic shoe. 
I'm gonna let you hold one too as well. Here, you hold this first pair, I'm gonna hold the second pair. All right, <clears throat> check out the details. Shout out to the camera work too. <laughs> if y'all can see this camera woman right now, whoo wait. <laughs> but anywho, we gotta talk about these shoes right here. Now, KK, I saw that look in your eye. You said, man, I've had something like this before. Not as crazy of a colorway, but I've had something like this. It's the Jordan 8, and obviously the Jordan 8s are iconic because, I mean, let's think, you go back to the movie Space Jam, Bugs Bunny, what is he wearing? Jordan 8s! That's how you got the Bugs Bunny Jordan 8s. But this one is, is uh, a little bit special to me because the story behind it, these are called the Dorenbacher Jordan 8s. What is Dorenbacher? So in Oregon, they have a children's hospital, it's called the Dorenbacher Children's Hospital. And obviously the children there are, you know, typically terminally ill, they're dealing with some serious stuff. But the cool thing about the hospital is each year they have their big charity event where they allow their children there to get a blank slate, Jordan, Nike, whatever, and get full access to customize it. I mean, that's what you never see this anywhere. And when you look at the details, if the camera can come a little closer, I mean, you see some of the things they're putting up here. Brave, right? Rock on. Obviously has his age, 14. You see the Jordan logo on this, but then he has the snake logo on that, right? Then on the interior part, believe. All these different quotables, all these different things that you would never traditionally get on a Jordan. You get these on these Dornbachers because these children are able to have full access to create them. And then to add that last beautiful element that I love, when you purchase these shoes, proceeds go back to the hospital. So not only are you getting a crazy one of a kind kick, but you're also making an impact. And you know how we feel about making impacts. So. You know, that's why I figured I had to break out the door blockers, baby. I would give him one more, but you know what, KK? I don't care if you want to give him one more. We're not giving them any more heat this episode. If they want more, they got to come back next time, KK. But what should they do to this video? They need to, it's a couple things. They got to like it first, right? Mm -hmm. And then subscribe. You, if they're not subscribed, what are they doing? <laughs> and, and should they comment if they want to see more shoes? Because we got plenty more shoes to show them, right? Mm -hmm. So y'all heard her, like the video, make sure you subscribe to the video, comment below on, you know, if you like those kicks, if there are certain kicks that you want to see as well, we got exclusive feet, we got whatever you need, baby. But either way, appreciate y'all for tuning in, and until next time, KK, peace. Yes. Thank you.